Before I get into this video, if you guys want the chance to win 2,000 credits, go join my giveaway. Watch the video at the top right to learn how to enter. The giveaway winner announcement and the new giveaway video are going to be up tomorrow. I'm going to let a few more people join because some guy decided to subscribe to my channel with like 10 or 12 accounts. So I'll pick a winner once I reach around 208 subs. At the time I'm recording this, it's raining. So if you hear water droplets hitting my AC, just ignore that. Also, make sure to watch until the end of this video because I had a secret word in it. The first person to find it will win 200 credits for absolutely free. Hey guys, Exowistic here back with another video and the like streak is still alive. Let's keep the streak going. Let's go for 40 likes on this episode for a part 5 of this series. Starting off with the first trade, I sold one of my NCI for 70 credits. In this trade, I'm selling the title stream that I got last episode for 900 credits. Here, I sold it for 1000 making 100 credits profit. This is a short trade, this guy just wanted to buy one NCVR. In this trade, I'm just buying two black market gold explosions, both for under minimum price. Electroshock and Solar Flare sell faster than Toon, so if you guys are going to buy and sell black market gold explosions, Toon should definitely be your last option. Here, I decided to take this item overpay for Bubbly. This guy offered Saffron Draco, Spectre, two NCVR, a non cray exotic wheel, and 90 credits. This offer totals up to 1,140 credits. It's not one of the craziest item overpays, but I decided to take it because this guy really wanted bubbly and because always taking credits gets boring. I started recording really late here, but I bought a solar flare for 150 credits. After days of waiting, I was finally able to sell the Burnt Sienna Zombas for a tune and 20 credits. Before I got this offer, some guy offered me 200 credits and I was about to accept, but I decided to wait just a little bit longer. And then this guy messaged me. This is why I say always be patient. In this trade, I sold the Spectre that I got from the item overpay for Bubbly. I got 300 credits for it, which is mid price. Always try to sell your items for mid price. If it's taking too long to sell, then you can try selling for minimum price. For this trade, this guy messaged me saying he wanted to buy all of my NC. VR. He bought all 6 of them for 240 credits. In this trade, I sold my Electroshock for a little bit of an overpay. I got 300 credits, a Dominus I can sell for 100, and 2 non-crate imports that I can probably sell for 60 or 70 credits each. So I just got 590 credits worth of stuff for a black market that I only paid 350 credits for. In this trade, I sold the Solar Flare for 250 credits. I only bought this for 100, so I made 150 credits profit. In this one, I decided to trade my Titanium White Apparatus wheels because nobody is buying them. I decided to trade them for these orange striker chronos. This is still a bad wheel but I figured since it's striker I would have an easier time selling it. Here I sold my other solar flare for 250 credits making another 100 credits profit. In this trade I sold the saffron dracos for mid price which is 450 credits. Here I bought some sky blue zombas for 800 credits. I'm going to try to sell these for 1000 but there's no guarantee I'll actually get that. I've been trying to sell some sky blue zombas on my main account and nobody wants to buy them for 1000 which is why I think this wheel is going to drop soon but i'm still gonna try i forgot to record the first part of this trade because i was extremely tired but before i bought this atomizer i bought a trigon from this same guy for 300 credits after that is when I bought his atomizer for 200. In this trade, I sold my sky blue zombas to my friend, so I decided to give him a 100 credit discount. He got them for 50 credits under minimum price, and I still made 100 credits profit. Here, I finally managed to sell the Dracos that I bought in the last episode for 600 credits. Someone finally decided to buy them for mid price, which is 800, so I made 200 credits profit. In this trade, I bought an Electroshock and a Party Time, both for 50 credits under minimum price. This is a quick one, just buying a tune for 150 credits. In this trade, I sold an Atomizer for 300 credits and I bought it for 200, so again, I made 100 credits profit. Here, I'm buying a title stream for 850 credits that I can easily sell for 1000. In this one, I'm selling an Electroshock and 450 credits. I paid 350, so I made another 100 credits profit here. Just selling another black market. This time, I sold Trigon for 450 credits and I bought it for 300. So, in this one, I made 150 credits profit. In this trade, I'm finally selling a tune for 250 credits. Here, I'm just selling the title stream for 1000 credits. I bought it for 850, so I made 150 credits profit in this trade. That's gonna be it for this episode. We finally managed to sell those disgusting Zombas and we have a decent amount of credits right now. I have two black market gold explosions that I will try to get rid of in the next episode. Our account is now worth about 4,810 credits. If you guys enjoyed this video or learned anything new, leave a like and let me know down below. Thank you guys for watching my videos and leaving nice comments. Stay safe, have a great day, and see you guys in the next video.